it's me again cuz period but y'all been knew that but anyway today I'm gonna tell y'all my do's and don'ts when going out to the motherfucking bar but I mean it's really like do's and don'ts for going to party just going out period cuz like it be shit going on like I but said, the do's and don'ts. So, when you go out, it'd be a lot of people around. You might not know them, but you might know them. But either way it go, all of these rules uh, apply for all of them. It don't matter if you know them. It don't matter if you don't know them. It applies. No matter what. But anyway, so like me personally, and anybody I'm with, if one of us got to go to the bathroom, we all go. If it's a group of girls, or even if we got some boys with us, we're going to make sure, like, you know, some of the boys go with that boy. Or we're going to stand outside that bathroom. Because, no. Just as well as shit be happening to females, shit be happening to niggas, too. Or, like, they could get kidnapped, too. Or, you know, we drunk, you will never know what could happen. So, yeah. Change that. I'm gonna start. One go to the bathroom, we all go to the bathroom. Period. Like, so if you ever out with me and you notice, like, oh, you go, start walking to the bathroom, so I like, get right behind you. That's why. You know, play that. One go outside to do whatever. Oh, we outside. Like, basically, moral story is whoever you went with, stay with them the whole time because you'll never know what could happen. Like, and it takes seconds, literally, for shit to, you know, occur. Another thing is, when you get a drink, if you sit that drink down and walk off, and none of your friends are sitting right there with that drink, or whatever, that drink over with. Don't drink it. You never know what got put in that drink while you weren't paying attention. It's really important. But, yeah, that's really important. Um, just those are a few things like you know, er, stick together, pay attention to your drink, uh, pay attention to your cards, your keys, your cash, your purse, whatever. If you decide one fucker to get drunk and lose shit, have a designated person in your group who don't get you know. I'm usually the designated motherfucker. Everybody get that shit to me because wherever Adriana go, her purse go. Believe it or not. I have a purse or something. Like, I don't play like that. Because I be having my keys and shit on me too. So, have a, de have a designated person to hold that shit for you if you don't leave it in the car. Simple, my Another thing is, if y'all somewhere that y'all know the area, always take a picture of where you park so you can remember like you know that's what i do like when i'm out of town i always take a picture of where i park like the background if it's a parking deck i take a picture of like you know the numbers or the letters or whatever but yeah just be aware of y'all surroundings because it'd be a lot of going on when you have a bartender try to remember their name try to remember what they look like try to remember what the people at the door look like just because you'll never know what people be on um, so yeah, just to be aware is to be alive for real. Like, shit get weird out here. So just be mindful of y'all surroundings and y'all situations and what y'all got going on. But yeah, those are my do's and don'ts of going out. But y'all can like, comment, subscribe.